10 Facts About the Javan Rhino Once one of the most widespread rhinoceroses, the Javan rhinos ranged from the islands of Java and Sumatra and were spread throughout Southeast Asia and in India and China. Today, the species is critically endangered, with only 74 of these majestic creatures found in the Ujung Kulon National Park in Indonesia. The decline of these beautiful animals is down to poaching, largely due to their horns that are used in traditional Chinese medicine. So today, we're going to talk about 10 facts about these beasts that you probably didn't know about. Now before we begin, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel, top best for everything, for more content like this. Number 10. Rare Horns the horns of a Javan rhino are one of the most expensive materials on the planet, with the horn fetching as much as $30,000 per kilogram on the black market. These horns are used in the manufacture of traditional Chinese medicine. Apparently, these horns are grounded into a powder and then put in boiling water to treat rheumatism, gout, and other ailments. Number 9. Poison Detection One of the rare properties of Javan rhino horn is that it can help cure snake bites. Greek mythology claims that the horn also possesses the ability to purify water, while the ancient Persians believe that the horn can be used to detect poisonous liquids. Number 8. A rhino has many names. Okay, so one of the most unique things about these rhinos is that all remaining Javan rhinos have unique names, and one of them is called Rawing. This friendly bloke is one of the old heads at Kulan National Park and is the poster boy for the efforts being made to increase Javan rhino population. Number 7. Conservation Goals WWF has been focused on not just increasing rhino population, but also making their survival safe and happy. One of the main goals of the organization is to restore 190 hectares of preferred rhino habitat. The organization is currently working with locals to remove the orenga palms in order to clear the path for a proper rhino habitat. Number 6. Short Lifespan for a species that weighs around 2.3 tons, the Javan rhinos don't live that long. Their average lifespan in the wild is around 30 to 45 years. On top of that, Javan rhinos are solitary animals and can be seen with the others only when they're mating or when the females are with their mothers. This is why it is even more important than ever before to create circumstances that would help these creatures multiply. Number 5. Mud Bath the Javan rhinos do love a mud bath. The process is called wallowing and allows them to maintain cool body temperatures. This also helps them stay away from disease and parasite infestation. Funnily enough, despite their love for a mud bath, Javan rhinos don't like to dig their own wallows and instead use those made by other animals. Number 4. Marking Territory like a lot of animals, male javans like to mark their territories with dung piles and urine spraying. However, it is now known whether they are territorial like many other animals who jealously guard their territory and don't take kindly to trespassers. Number 3. No Zoos on Show the last time a Javan rhino was exhibited in a zoo was in the 19th century, where four of these creatures were put on show for visitors of museums in Adelaide, London, and Calcutta. The Javans don't do well in captivity, where their lifespan is slashed to 20 years. Moreover, captive rhinos don't give birth in captivity. Number 2. Weapon Making The Javan horns were used in Yemen, since the horn's luster increases with age, it is used for the handles of curved daggers, also called jambia. These daggers are presented to Yemeni boys at the age of 12 and considered a sign of manhood and devotion. In China, these horns were carved into ceremonial cups as well as buttons and hairpins during 7th century AD. Number 1. A Myth Debunked However, the greatest fact about the Javan rhino horn is that the composition of their horn does not indicate if it can cure any disease or neutralize poisonous agents. Research has moved to dispel the myth, but I guess it's a little too late. The horns have a thin layer of keratin, and the precise composition depends on diet and geographic location. The structure is similar to hooves and beaks of turtles, 
Overall, there isn't much evidence to support the plethora of claims about the healing properties of the horns. In 1990, researchers at Chinese University in Hong Kong found that large doses of rhino horn extract could slightly lower fever in rats. That's all for today. Now make sure you subscribe to the channel for more and comment down below what fact about the Javan rhino you thought was the most interesting.